kiss for you. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development and so guys this will be the part 3 of my video series on how to integrate the advanced native admob ads in your android application using the sector views all right guys so in our previous part of the videos we had created the model then we created the or i mean we copied the json file then we uh, got all the data from our json and stored in our array list of type object here you can see okay so now what we need to do is basically okay so now we can uh, write the method to load the native ads okay so after you add all the menu items from json so here let's have the method that is load native ads okay so let's create this new file i mean the new method and what this method will do is it will create the native ads so first of all here we can say add loader dot builder and we can name it as builder equal to new add loader dot builder and here we can pass this then we can say get the sources dot get string r dot string dot add unit id okay so we have specified our add unit id and then we can say add loader that we initialized globally and we can say builder dot for unified native add and here we can say new unified native add loaded listener and here we can say dot with add listener and here we can have new add listener and here we can say on add fail to load and finally we can say dot build all right so basically here now we have this own unified add uh, native add loaded and then we have this on add fail to load okay so now inside our own unified uh, native add loaded method what we can do is we can say native ads and we can add our add and we can say unified native add and then we can check if add loader dot is not loading so if the add loader is no loading so we can say insert ads in menu item okay so we will add it and also here inside our on add fail to load method here we can also say if add loader dot is loading and here we can say insert add in menu item all right and after this build we can simply say add loader dot load ads since we have multiple ads and here we can say new add request dot builder dot build and then we can say number of ads all right so let's create this insert add in menu item method okay 
and then here we can add the, them inside our menu item so for that we can say if native ads dot size is less than zero then just return and else we can okay so now what we can do is we will first of all fetch the offset and then add the uh, add inside that offset so for that we can say int offset equal to recycler view items dot size and it will be divided by native ads dot size plus one okay and then we have the index equal to zero then we can have a for loop so for unified native ad and native ad so here we can simply add it so we can say recycler view items dot add and here we will pass our index and we can pass our add also okay and finally we can increment our add index so we can say index equal to index plus offset all right and finally we can simply load our menu and so we will load it okay so now we will be requiring the recycler view adapter for that so here we can say recycler view dot adapter and we can say adapter equal to new recycler view adapter and we can pass this and recycler view items and finally we can say recycler view dot set adapter and we can say adapter here all right so now we have created this uh, recycler view then we added the menu items then we embedded the native ads into our menu items and okay so guys i think that is enough for this video so i will create the adapter in our next part of the video so if you like the video please like share and subscribe goodbye